Good morning, folks. Welcome back. Hope you all had a very Merry Christmas. We had a really good time going back, seeing Damaris's family. The weather was kind of bad, so we actually got stuck there an extra day. It's because they shut all the roads down. But we made her home. We're back. We're working. Uh, we kind of did a rotating schedule, so we each got a couple days off over the holidays. But yeah, we got some snow. I don't know how much there is exactly, maybe five, six inches. Um, so I'm just feeding the calves this morning. Got to go around and feed a few groups of cows. We finally got a guy to come and grind some hay so it makes feeding a lot quicker. Um, we can just throw in that ground hay, get her all mixed up with the silage and the corn and ready to feed. So it makes it a lot nicer. But now I got to, Angus is chasing some grouse, so I got to go find him. Come on, buddy. There he comes. I saw him. You gotta run around the whole thing of bales. But he's coming. He'll, he'll uh, come and wish you guys a Merry Christmas too and a Happy New Year. There you are, buddy. Good job. Good boy. Good boy. Did you get the grouse? Did you get them? Unfortunately, one of our pickups with the hydro bed is in the shop and the other one, the four wheel drive isn't working right now. So instead of rolling bales out with pickups, got to use the tractor just here for a couple of days. But hey girls, how you doing? The, uh, we're not having to give hay to all of our groups of cows, just a couple of them, where we're kind of running out of stockpiled grass. So these ones, We've got a few pastures left where we got some other cows grazing where they're fine. They don't need any feed, but a couple of these pastures and fields are just going to be where we keep them about until when we calf. So we got to start feeding some of these groups of cows some hay. We usually just keep an eye on the cows, on their body condition, see how they're looking. These cows look pretty good, but there's not much feed left in these fields here. So we got to supplement with some hay and with some with some uh, protein supplement as well. But yeah, we just, we keep track of how our cows are looking, how their body condition is for this time of year. Keep track of how much grass is still out in the pasture and then we decide, you know, if we need to supplement feed or substitute feed or what. But these cows will be happy to get a little hay today. Here in my seat, get down. Other incidents, other scandals, all these politicians, not just them. Get down. Good boy. of antelope is back they're running through my fence right now so <laughs> hopefully they aren't breaking it down they probably are I'll have to go check antelope are kind of hard on fences what'd you make for lunch honey chicken noodle soup, chicken noodle soup. how was your soup buddy yeah. No. Good, what are we gonna do now? We're gonna go sledding. We're gonna go sledding because Silas got a sled for Christmas. And Grandma. Yeah, I can put him in. Huh? I can put him in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's go for a ride, buddy. Come back, him up. In case you I get wild. Him up yesterday. You might yeah. get wild, guys. Where's his gloves? Oh yeah, let me go grab 
Arnie's gonna go get the gloves. <laughs> All better? He doesn't let me put them oh. in there. No, they're not very fun. It's okay, buddy. Oh no. That's not helpful. <laughs> you are too chalky. Wow. A year from now, you're going to be pulling your brother around. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you want to say hi? You're taking him on a bumpy road. A snowball in oh. <laughs> Daddy needs a break. <laughs> you got a Too snowball. Many <laughs> <laughs> Too many Christmas cookies. Yeah. <laughs> Can feel it. <laughs> Alright, buddy. Daddy's got to go back to work. Uh, See you later. You Take care of your mama. See you later, hon. Have fun. Angus, come on. Come on. Huh? Nap time? No, he's not. Huh? See you, bud. <laughs> okay, see you guys later. See ya, Come on, let's go. Unfortunately, in one of the pastures where we have our cows, our well, something went wrong with it. It's, it wasn't the pump, the pump was all right. The well still has water, but something electrical, I don't know, something went wrong. So our cows up here ran out of water. We put them in to a neighbor's pasture that we leased for a few days until we were trying to figure out what to do with them. Um, and we just decided we're gonna bring them home, back to the home place. It's only a couple miles. I'm gonna try and trail them down right now. My dad brought the tractor up. He's leading them. They're starting to come to where he is. I'm just gonna stay behind him with the four-wheeler. We need to get them down there where they have water. They had water in the neighbor's place where we had them, but we'd like to get them onto our place, you know. We uh, usually lease that stuff in the, in the summer and they were gracious enough to just let us, help us out in a pickle, put our cows there for a few days, but you know, we don't wanna overstay our welcome, so. We're gonna move these cows right now. There's nothing quite like black cows on some fresh white snow. It's just a good view. Beautiful day. Of unfortunate this happened because we've probably got <clears throat> I don't know 500 acres up here that we graze the cows in in the winter until probably end of January so we're taking them out of here like a whole month early and that means we're moving them on to pasture that we weren't planning on having them using up that grass which we weren't planning on doing 
it's just the way things go sometimes but we've got a guy looking at the well hopefully he'll be able to fix it we probably won't bring these back up here but just uh, another thing that happens things are always happening you spend your whole time on a ranch trying to put out fires and then this time of year you get a little time to try and prevent some fires and then more fires just pop up. It's all right. What's up, little guy? Oh, oh, he's gone. My dad's down there opening the gate, then he'll probably take off. I'll bring him through the trees under the interstate. And then they're kind of going in some pasture right over there in the in the foothills here. Come on, girls. Down the hill. Come on. Come on. Down the hill. Let's go. <laughs> Let me just put them with the rest. I'll just leave them there. Okay. Sounds good. Hot water. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Come on, 16, come on. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Let's go. Come on. Come on, 16. I don't have any cake. I'm sorry. Come on, girls. Come on. Just a little further. Come on. Hey. They're headed through the tunnel underneath the interstate. We've got a pasture in between the interstate and the highway. Where we want them to end up is on the other side of the highway over there. But we're just gonna leave them in between the highway and interstate tonight. Fences are real good. We'll come back tomorrow. We'll move them the rest of the way. It's just getting too dark. We're running out of daylight. It looks light on camera, but it's a lot darker than it. It's a lot darker in real life. So gotta get these last few and we'll be good.
job, girls. We'll see you tomorrow. Set this panel up. That way they don't turn around and go back tonight. Ugh.